All right, here with Mo. Uh, start with James Ham. Hey, Mo, before this goes uh, to social justice stuff, which I know it will go to, uh, I just want to ask you about the game um, tonight. Just how are you fitting in with this team and, and what do they need to do to figure this thing out? Uh, where one night you come out and you play well and then you can't back it up with another night like tonight? Um, you know, f first, I think I should give my teammates a lot of credit for, um, you know, welcoming me and, and allowing me to fit in so easily. Um, you know, they, they've done a great job making me feel comfortable and, and allow me to be myself. So that, that that's made the transition easy. Um, for, for as far as what I think we're missing is I think just a little bit of consistency. Like, you know, we came out last game with the with that defensive effort, you know, against a team like Dallas, who's who's a pretty good offensive team. And, you know, we got to carry that over. Like, that was a good feeling after that game, how everyone was feeling. We got to be able to carry that over and, and start the game the same way tonight. Uh, you know, we played back and forth a lot for the whole game pretty much, and that's not how we're going to win. Um, we got to find some consistency on the defensive end because we can't, we can't just think we're going to have a shootout every night and win. Sean Cunningham. That that fourth quarter was it a matter of just going cold on your guys' end? I mean, I think it, it was a mix of um, you know, we we weren't making them feel uncomfortable at all, so they were getting easy baskets. And when you know, in the fourth quarter, when you get easy baskets, you get a chance to set your defense. So we're playing we're like we like to play fast and, and and have teams off balance, but we're coming down the court every time against a set defense in the fourth quarter, and you know that that's that's tough. So they they credit to them, they did a good job in the game of uh, turning up their defense, but we just got to be better. Jason Jones. Yeah, I'm all about that going against their set defense. What can you, how much is the problem going against that defense was that offensively you guys got stagnant during the fourth and didn't do some of the things you were doing in the first three quarters that allowed you guys to score? Yeah, they, um, you know, in the fourth quarter, they, they were switching a lot more. Um, and and they, we played a little bit too much one-on-one, -on -one, I feel like. You know, it, we got to just continue to do what we do and, and not get tired of it. You know, we, we were leading for a lot of the game, especially in the second half until they went on that run late. Um, you know, we just got to continue to just do what's working and, and not get tired of it, you know, and, and just just stay focused for 48 and, and follow the game plan. I mean, it's, it's just it's the same thing. It boils down to consistency, you know, on both ends of the floor. Jason Anderson. Hey, Mo, I wanted to ask you about the fans uh, in the arena as well. Um, just a limited number, but, you know, is that enough for you guys on the floor to, to kind of feel that and then draw some energy from them? Yeah, absolutely. You know, it's like you said, it's a limited number, but, you know, just having some of that that energy in the building, like even pregame, it felt different, you know, and, and just we're excited to have some fans in there. Um, it, it was kind of hard to tell between the cardboards and real fans when you look out in the crowd, but, uh, it was definitely good to have that energy back, and I'm excited to to continue to have that fans in the building. Um, I know the fans here are really good, and I know they're excited to come watch us play. Sean Cunningham. Yeah, Mo, and I, I wanted to ask about just your reaction, the team reaction. How just how much did the what you guys saw from the verdict today? Uh, how much was it a topic of discussion and kind of dominate your guys' conversations? You know, we um we had conversations about it. Um, you know, we, we kind of just opened the floor for guys to, you know, talk about how they felt about it. Um, you know, for me, obviously, I'm, 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 I'm glad that, you know, some accountability was, 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 was given in the situation. Um, I think as a, as a whole, you know, it's great. It's a, it's a, it's a start. But I think we got to get to a point where, you know, when a murderer gets charged with murder, it's not a celebration. You know, it's, it's, it was supposed to happen, you know, and, and I think that's that kind of, you know, illustrates where we are right now as a as a whole. And you know, we just gotta we gotta use this moment and and, and just grow. You know, uh, it's a, it's a great it's a great thing that happened. And um, you know, hopefully we continue to build on this and and, and make change.